Hey what's up guys, Will here. In today's video I'm going to be introducing the all new app to iOS, which is the news app. This will be coming out with the release of iOS 9. So this is pretty much a flipboard for iOS and it's going to be very similar. You're going to be able to choose your topics and people that you would like to follow or subscribe to kind of. And then for you sections going to update. This is the beta version but then it works pretty similar uh, to when the real one is going to be released. There could be some minor changes, but nothing big. So you can search for categories, and it's also the kind of its own little app store, kind of. You can explore some things here, and this is all coming up. And you can go to sections, you can do all that kind of stuff, and then you can save stories, kind of bookmark them. But when you do open a story, let me just show you kind of how that Kind of system works so when you open up a story it'll show you right there in the bottom left that who is sending you a story like what kind of blog or person blog yeah like what kind of company is uh that story from and then when you click on it you can click read that full story or just swipe down and swipe up and then it will load the story and you can get all of that there and then it's pretty much going to be like the internet there so you're gonna have ads and all that kind of stuff and then you can swipe back and then continue so it's just kind of a home for all your news pretty similar to Flipboard you know it's just gonna get it from different sources so then you can subscribe to you want you can take any of those people off I mean this part almost looks identical if you know what Flipboard is it's another kind of news app and then you can go to software you can even search they have lots of subcategories so if you like music and say like Taylor Swift they can go with that that was one of the examples they gave that's what you can go pretty specific to get a specific person like Taylor Swift and you can add them I'm not going to do that for right now but they have topics and channels so topics it's not going to show you it from a person and it's going to do this it's going to show you all the topics that have to or all the articles that have to do with that topic and then when you're doing a channel it's all the articles that are on that person's or companies, a blog, or a website. So that's how it's going to sort that there. And then you can see it updates quite often. Or Taylor Swift is again. <laughs> uh, but it does update quite often to show you all that kind of stuff. So then you can save stories by pressing this bookmark button right there or favorite them. And then you can also share them. And you can email them and put them in the notes app or do any of those stuff. So this is not available right now. This is coming out in the fall of this year. And if you are, depending on the time you are watching this, this may be all available for you. This is going to come with the new update on iOS 9. So this is one of the new features. And I'm going to be doing other videos with new features on iOS 9 and some other things. So if you like this kind of stuff and you like tech videos, you can subscribe to my channel and leave a like down below. Comment. And if you can share this video, that helps a lot. Thank you so much for watching.